Hey everyone, I'm Round the Wheel, you're watching Oh No More Talismans, and today we are going to go back to a spot of boulder, and this time we're going to put some elbow grease on it. we got to save 20 lemmings without using any builders, which, I don't know, kind of making your way downtown, uh, face is past and we're homebound. Uh, this might be one we're able to play by ear. Let's see if we can do it. It is just a bronze one after all, although I have definitely made a hash of bronze ones in the uh, not too distant past. So I think first of all, let's see, which way do I want to send a guy first? Let's see, we have eight of everything, which should be a quite a quite good to handle this. So I'm gonna send a climber first. Everybody gets shuttled in, that's just fine. Um, so if I, okay, and we have floaters too even, so that's really nice. So let's go ahead and get people bashing. We should be able to go just about any direction we please with impunity. We just have to be sure to save them from the vaporizing traps, uh, which we can check on. We can probably mine through these little floors right here, and we can check for accuracy with the uh, physics engine. So let's let him go and do his thing for a little bit. All right. He's going to go and do his thing now. He's going to get up on the dance floor. Let's give the drummer some more. All right, so he goes there. I think this one is going to be pretty simple. I could be wrong, but seems like a pretty easy one to do. This was this was a pretty nice little NES style level, but okay. So now now let's make sure now let's make sure with physics that we don't trigger these things. Still mine in a good spot, but yeah, there we go. And then pop past it that way. Yeah, there we go. Wait a second, wait a sec. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. I meant to click the physics trap thingy. But now I see that he will climb over the, the thingy. Uh-oh, that's no good. And I have to not use any builders. Oh, boy. Well, how do I get that going then? Okay, let's go back and do what we did before. Yep, he's gonna climb up that doggone wall. Uh, hmm, and I have to save all of them, do, do I not? Doe and tie. Oh my. Okay, well that's gonna be the only hard part is making sure no climbers go over that last wall there. Um, actually we may be able to hack him. Can we hack him out? any other way doesn't look like it uh okay let's back this up a few steps um well hold on we may be able to save him with a little t tiny bit of mining let's see here if i how much of this can we preserve here maybe one more frame but does that get rid of the whole thing? It does, so that's no good. Uh, okay, why don't you try, maybe we can try coming back the one step like I thought. But it looks like it, well, that could, no, I think that'll create just enough of a bit. Yeah, that, that creates a little kind of diagonal pixel hole that he will go through there. Oh, and he does it twice anyway, so it's the whole thing is academic. So, all right. Okay, so I need to think a little harder at least to figure out how to get somebody going. Uh, to keep somebody from going over the wall this way, because I have to save all my guys, and I feel like I can... I feel like I can do this. I feel like I can... Uh, I feel like... Hmm... I, this is the only part that has me really confused right here, because the rest is fairly simple. I, well, I guess, because then if I send somebody over this way to do it, then he ends up going over that way as well. Well, hold on. Okay, yeah. No, just a second. Don't do that. Uh, I could just have him hack through that over and over again, but why would I? Um, okay, that didn't work either. And he can't just mine on the ground. That doesn't work at all. Yeah, you can't just do that. Can you dig on the ground? No, you can't do that either. 
Well, what about bashing through steel? How about that? Oh, okay, okay. Well, that works. All right, so uh, then you would just have to have your uh, uh, climbers bash into steel. Hopefully, I have enough bashers to make that work out. Okay, we've mined our way through these little traps right here. Okay, so now... Now it's just a matter of getting them to go... The, uh, how many bashers do... I, I think I may only need one climber left to do this. So, send one up over the way. He bumps on that. Save the rest. Bash. Oh, another one won't even go that way. So, okay, well... Yeah, everybody else can kind of save themselves. So we do one more climber. There we go. Alright, so he comes over and does that. Now we have bashers going all through this and that. Can you go through the... Yeah, he can bash through at that point. They can both do a job. Very good. They can both do jobs simultaneously. Very nice. Okay, so yeah, all he has to do to save himself is climb the wall, bump into this thing, turn around, climb up here. So we'll make him a floater. Alright. Yeah, good job. And then the rest of them can save themselves as they see fit. That leaves only two bashers needed left, and we have three remaining. So, we did it! We did our job. We did our job like good little lemming saviors. Good for us. Let's skip a few frames there. And... Yeah, okay, that guy saved himself. Very good. And then he bashes through there. They all walk underneath the framalizers. Very good. And they all walk to the exit. There we go. Not too bad. A spot of not very much bother, I would call that one. That one was not too bad. Not too bad indeed. Next up is Don't Panic. All screamy caps. Gotta save all 30 lemmings for a silver talisman. So the normal requirement is 25. Now we have to save 30. Let's see what that entails. We have a pretty limited selection of items here. With this structure over here, I'm thinking we're going to have to dig through here. And then also, or maybe right here, get here somehow, and then bash here. But how do we hold everybody else off? How... How, 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 how indeed. How, 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 how. So, hmm, this is definitely a toughie. Uh, I feel like maybe we could, well, no, we can't really go over the top because if we bash through this thing right here, that means we use up our one basher. Unless, some, well, maybe, maybe we can go over the top, uh, but it might take some doing. Alright, so we've got... Okay, we're going to have to save pretty close to everybody. Yeah, pretty close. I mean, 30, that's as close as it gets, right? Okay, so we're going to save two guys by building. We're going to try that first. Okay, we're going to seal up this hole. Very good. The hole is... Actually, we can do this a different way. Uh, we don't need... Okay. We can just build up to kind of wherever... Well... No, we're going to have to get a little higher up, so... Yeah, let's do it the way we were doing it. Let's use two bridges right there. Okay, so replay over. Let's go ahead and now... If I can get to the top using two bridges, if I can get above this little curve up here, I'd like to do that. First of all, I'm going to set the release rate to 99. Uh, for reasons. Uh, we want to... Okay, one... Okay, one, two, three. Okay, this is gonna be really dicey, and I don't really know how to slow everyone down from this point, but... Okay, well, you can kinda... Another guy can kinda fall in with the crowd there. Alright, so... Here we go. This is gonna... This is gonna be awkward, but I hope it works out. Um, actually, I may have wanted to get a little lower than that, so let's, let's, uh, undo it. I kind of want to get the bridge up to where I'm bashing, to about right here, and then build up to here, and then I'm going to kind of hope against hope 
Uh, this might be a little bit of a wing and a prayer type situation. How low do I want to get here? Still want the 99 release rate, yes. Actually, we might be able to do this with two bridges, which would be really nice. Uh, so let's go ahead and do that then. Okay, yeah, a mess of lemmings are walking around up here. But we do have one kind of separated guy. Okay, yes. There we go. Once he gets up against the wall, he'll be able to bash through. Hopefully we can kind of keep the... Okay, we can kind of keep the big group intact here. Alright. Okay, well, that went poorly. Alright, so... No, we want to back that up. So we have two builders. Alright, so somebody needs to go through the wall here. And let's see how that works out for us. Okay, so they go through. Okay, he's alone for the most part. Though there are a lot of lemmings catching up to him. Maybe by the time some others get out, we can kind of clear out the way here. No, 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 no. Okay, yeah, that's kind of what I figured would happen. And yeah, I panicked and did a bad build anyway. But we can get up to there. But then how do we... Mm, but then how do we hold everyone off? Is my question. I kind of want to keep it localized to up here. Maybe if we start over and just do it with a really slow release rate. Let's try it that way. So, do our thing like we did earlier. Alright, don't fall off. Don't panic. Do what Coldplay says, don't panic. And go up here. I kind of like what we have going here right now, but... But I'm gonna kind of... I'm gonna see how many Lemmings mess around with this guy if he does his job with a with the release rate at the lowest rate. Ooh, that's pretty good. That turned out kind of semi-perfectish. Alright, so a basher goes through. We don't even have everybody out yet. Let's see what the let's see what the crowd looks like. Okay, it looks more or less the same. In fact it even looks maybe marginally a little worse than it did. Uh yeah, too many lemmings coming still. This is not this is not how this is done, I don't think. This is not This is not the way the truth and the life right here. I'm not I'm not seeing it. Maybe it's not going through the ceiling. Maybe it's just a way of going down around this way and slowing everybody down. Although I still don't see It'd still be pretty tough to get Well, maybe you can uh hmm well, hold on just a second. Okay. Okay, I kind of was looking at something here. This is a little bit ugly and janky, but it's going to look really cool. Uh, and we might be able to even use a blocker to do it this way. Um, okay. So, yeah. I'm going to build up just a little. Alright, so... I just want to build up just a teensy weensy bit. So, okay, new plan. Yeah, we want to build to about here. We want to go through this little... No, no, that doesn't work. Because I was going to bash through to here. And maybe end up bashing through this thing. Bash, bash, bash. Hit one of these little holes. And get, no, that doesn't work. Because I have to bash through here. That doesn't work. Uh, I'm going to need a minute to think on this, methinks. Okay, nothing I can think of that keeps them pinned in up here seems to work. Because I just don't have enough builders. I If I try to do a builder trap to keep a bunch of them in and have like one straggler build up here, I just don't have enough builders. Because I have to seal this off with two if I want to do it that way. And then a builder trap takes three, so that's five. Six to get up here. I have no way of getting over this. So I just don't think I have enough builders to get over this way. And so I'm going to try my luck going down a little. Let's try let's try going down into the into the thick of the of the vaporizer here. Let's let's go into the let's travel into the fog. 
How can we slow people down? The where's first of all, where's the trap? It's right there. Okay, it's like just underneath. So let's try that. Let's see who. Let's see how fast this moves. So I can probably get pretty close to the trap. Okay, so does that does that save him in time? No, that doesn't. He just got straight up zorched. That doesn't work. So we gotta slow the tide somehow a little. How do we want to do that? We can let this guy go forward. How can we slow... Well, hold, okay, so let's try this. Alright, I'm gonna put a builder right here. Okay, that should and that should extend the road a little, so that might give him a little bit of extra time to work on that. So let's go ahead and get close to that. All right, see if that saves. See if that saves a life. Does that do it? Does that do it? Okay, that's okay. But then we've still got people coming. There's not really any way to make an effective blocker trap here because I'm fairly certain in order to get to the exit I'm going to need to dig here and bash here which means I'm going to need to save all that and somehow like keep everybody back but okay so he's finishing up let's see um Okay, maybe... No, let's let him... Okay, let's let him stop for now. Let's let the other one do what I was going to do there. Okay, hold the right arrow key. Yes, there you go. All right. All right, so how much how much time do I have here? I don't have much time to make this really happen. Okay, so that gets pretty close to sealing it up. I like it, but there's somebody coming in hot. Uh, at least one living. Okay, so maybe if he seals it up. Okay, well that. Okay, well that does that. Yeah, but see, then the rest of them are coming. There's no way I can build fast enough over this pit to to get through that. As soon as I start building, here come here come the pretzels. Yeah, no matter how close I get, yeah, we lose a few. One, two, three, four, five. Well, we could at least beat the level. That, no, we couldn't because we just lost the sixth one. No, we didn't. We have 25 out unless there's another one about to come out. No, we have 25 out and 25. Oh, but see, even then, somebody's too close behind him. I don't even know why I'm still trying to go at this point, honestly. But yeah, the only thing I can really reasonably think of well you could just start from here I suppose well no you would want at least to get down far enough to there we go yeah you get down far enough to get through that yeah that's you would want to do that there that's the only way I can see to get through this I don't think I can get through this I did some off-camera research, building up to here, just letting lemmings die. And if you bash through this, you don't get low, no matter how low on it you get, you don't get low enough to make holes that they can stop bashing right here and just kind of free the whole lot. So, I mean, this beats the level the normal way, but we need a talisman and we need to slow people down. How is that? going to be the case all right i've tried a million different ways of building to slow everybody down and none of them are working so i call uncle let's see how it works this is the first talisman i'm crying mercy on let's see how it's done i want to see the trick here okay there's a climber right there well that's one way to do it okay all right he goes up the wall that's a pretty nice little distraction how close are we to the trap here we're pretty close okay all right, so what goes on then from there? All right. Somebody goes on, goes on their merry way. He turns around to seal that up, I suppose. All right, lots of people sealing things up. Got to get this 
Okay, so we're just straight up sealing this up with a few bridges. Now he's building. Where's he building to? What's happening here? Climber goes back up the wall. What? Okay, so nobody's turning around. Or everybody is turning around, right? Wait just a minute. Here comes the climber. <gasps> oh! That's dirty pool. <laughs> oh, man. So, yeah. Okay. So, you hold everybody back by building just up to here. And then... Okay, that's extra devious. Okay. Wow. Okay, yeah. That's a little extra nasty. Because the exact kind of thing you're trying to avoid back in the crankshaft now they make you use it here just to do ah uh, oh i call shenanigans ah oh, man and then yeah there we go well i was right about this part you dig and you bash okay well that's certainly that certainly goes in the little bag of tricks i'll have to file that away for a rainy day uh, you know, should I ever make Lemmings levels that actually get uh, put out there in any kind of public capacity. But, golly goshums, that's, that's devious. Man, I almost feel like that should be a gold talisman. Because of the, not just because, like, I guess theoretically I could have figured it out if I'd have sat here long enough. But I have a full-time job and I have to sleep sometime. And my time is at least a little bit valuable. But I think I think the extra deviousness of having to avoid that trick earlier only to have to round back and use it later, ugh, that might that might be worth a gold, honestly. Um, but if that's only a silver in the estimation of the Lemmings Forums legacy compilers, then uh, what are some of the golds gonna look like?